Here we go, folks. Welcome back to Celtic Fans TV. It is time for the starting 11 prediction for tomorrow's trip to face Hamilton away in the league. Before we get started with tonight's video, I want to first of all say a Merry Christmas to all of you. I hope you have a wonderful time. Stay safe. Enjoy it with your families if you can. Um, thank you to all of you for watching this year. It's been a difficult year for everyone, uh, a difficult year for the content as well. Obviously, we've all been doing the live streams, staying in the house. Um, we'd all love to be at the games, doing the content as usual, but the pandemic obviously hasn't allowed for that. But I want to say thank you to everyone who's supported the channel. Um, your support has been amazing throughout this whole journey, but particularly this year because we've had to change the content. Um, it's been pretty static, but it's just a live stream. It's mainly just me talking or some of the contributors on a live stream, um, static, just looking at their faces, talking all the time, three games a week. So thank you for putting up with us. Thank you for watching, liking, sharing the content. Um, we couldn't do this without you, and I hope you have a wonderful time. Hamilton come into this one, sitting 11th in the league. They've had two wins, two defeats, and one draw from their last five matches. They did get a good win against Ross County last week that resulted in Stuart Kettlewell losing his job but they are embroiled in that relegation battle down there. For us, we got a decent win at home against Ross County themselves uh, on Wednesday. So it's another win. That That's three in a row now, four in a row if you count the cup final as a victory as well, which it was just on a penalty shootout. Um, four wins in a row, building momentum, hopefully, towards the big game in January, but this is another must win for us. In terms of the team, I don't think there'll be too many changes from Wednesday night's game. Uh, I expect Hazard to start in goals. I think it will be a back four of Frimpong alongside Ayer, Julian and at left back. I'm going to go for Taylor. I know Laxalt started the other night there and this is one that's dividing a lot of supporters. But I just think because it's on a plastic pitch, which Greg Taylor is used to playing on, I think he's maybe more suited to start this game. Laxalt wasn't too bad the other night, but as I said, I just think he's a wee bit like a headless chicken at times, a wee bit cavalier. And when he gets into those crossing positions, I think his quality and use of the ball could be much better. So I think Neil Lennon will just go with Taylor in this game because it's on the plastic surface. In the midfield, I think we'll keep the diamond. I think it will be Sorrow at the base of it. I don't think Brown will be back fit yet, although I'm not sure how long he's going to be out for, if any length of time at all. Sorrow at the base, Christie at the right-hand side, Callum McGregor at the left-hand side. He'll probably captain the team as he did on Wednesday night. And I expect Turnbull to keep his place at the top of the diamond as well. He got his first league goal the other night, David Turnbull. Um, maybe not the best of his performances in, in his recent games, but he was still very good and it was brilliant to see him get on the score sheet. So I fully expect him to keep that place and he deserves to do so. We did see the partnership that everyone wants of Griffiths and Edward on Wednesday night. And I think that will continue against Hamilton uh, on Boxing Day. So I think it will be Griffiths alongside Edward, hopefully more game time together, they can work towards that level that we were producing at the back end of last season. I keep talking about that. I talked about it a lot in the content the other night. Um, we want to see them get back to those sort of levels. And I think they need game time together to do that. So I expect those two to start up top together. I've kept this brief. Um, I hope you enjoy the rest of your day. Have a brilliant time. We will be back with a uh, live full-time reaction after the game tomorrow, as always. So don't forget to like the video, comment with your own thoughts below. Who do you think will start? And don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. Uh, we'll see you tomorrow after the game. Cheers.